Hello everyone, my name is Seth here, and today, this is like my first time ever doing like a let's play of any kind at all, and uh, I'll be honest, I'm just a little bit nervous, so hopefully it all goes good. Um, I just want to say thank you so much to Danny, the Blue Recluse, for um, making this game, and I'm really excited to play it. I'm going to be honest, I've already played it a little bit before, but I'm going to play it um, again, but I promise no spoilers there. I'll put a link down in the description for the game if you yourself want to play it. I, uh, I really suggest you play it because um, just like a regular Sandersides game, um, or just like a regular Sandersides episode, it's much better to have the experience for you watching it or you doing it yourself because honestly I think that's what the series really wants to bring to the table. So um, I just want to say I love the, love the title screen music, it's really fun. All right, well, let me just make sure I'm recording really quick. I am, and without further ado, let's get in. All right, turn the room. Ugh, my head. What, where am I? Guess I should try and get out of here, wherever here is. I can't do a Tom's voice. All right, so, okay, I have Moving is the arrow keys, and I know when when you're in like RPG games, you're just like I want to click on everything. Oh, clicky, 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 clicky. Okay, we're gonna move. We're gonna move on. Pretty simple, really. Oh yeah. Um. Okay. When I played this the first time, these cracks didn't do anything, but I kind of want to see if they do. Oh damn. I can't. I can't. That's fine. Okay. I think it's fun if I could though, just fall through the floor. Whee! Alright, kind of like an undertale. Oh, oh, hello. I didn't know this happened. Hello, anyone there? I want to see what happens if I keep walking around now. Will anything happen? I don't want to keep you guys waiting, so I'm just going to do it for a little bit longer. I'll do one more lap. Oh. Looks well, like something straight out of a video game. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. I really want to see what it says. I don't want to have just silence though, so I'm going to talk through it. Do, 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 do. Is he going to say anything at all? All right, I'm just going to keep going just because I don't want to bore you guys. So here we go. Now loading. Ah, Logan! Back, shoot! You don't even make biological sense. Yes! Oh, big feet. Here, here the back goes. Thomas? What are you doing in the mindscape? I, I don't know. Wait, is this the mindscape? Isn't it supposed to look like a wherever I am at the time? Usually, yes, but I believe this is to be some type of abnormal nightmare. I'm in a nightmare? That's my best guess for the time being. Though the entire mindscape shouldn't be warped like this. How do I get out? I'm not sure. All I can fathom is that someone ventured into your subconscious and tampered with things they shouldn't have. What? Like a side? Like one of you? Technically, yes. Venturing through the subconscious is extremely dangerous, but it, it is possible. The only way to ensure this issue is fixed and you are returned to the real world is to follow whoever did this into the subconscious and undo the damage ourselves. Can we even do that? If we could find some of the others to help out, then yes. Particularly Virgil. His help would in be invaluable in this situation. So how do we find everyone? This nightmare is warping the entire mindscape. None of my knowledge of the area is useful. Well. We'll just have to explore what we can and hope we can find the others on the way. Ooh, I'm excited. <laughs> Logan, join your party. Hey. Oh. oh, I also noticed a path south leading to an area called Tutorial. I can only assume it will inform us of the rules of this new mindscape and how to navigate it. Go east. There seems to be some sort of village where we can talk. I need to inform you of what I've learned so far. Or you go south towards the Tutorial area. Wrong. I was using was. Okay. Um, we're gonna go this way because I want to try the tutorial. 
All right, there's a. Oh, that's that's cool. I like that. Yeah, let's go. Why not? All right. World falls based RPG rules. Party members and random monsters. Yeah, okay. Leveling up and all that stuff. Hope you already know. Definitely. Each channel will have shops and inn as you expect. You can buy various items from shops. The inn will replenish your HP and MP for a price. HP is your health, MP is your magical energy. Run out of it and you'll be able to use your special abilities. Ah! Now we can <laughs> open the menu using the escape. Oh, that's right. I forgot we had to do that. All right. Um, flip, flip. Okay. Good, good, good. Now for the battle system. Oh, here we go. Oh, a balloon? Okay. Okay, this, this is really cool. I'm gonna be honest. I'm geeking out. Having a hard time reading everything. Character special abilities are typically more powerful and useful with the attack button. You don't have a lot of special abilities now, but you will learn more as you level up there. Guard lets you spend your turn defending from any attacks. Ooh. Okay, good to know. I don't usually guard because I'm an attack, attack, attack type person, but sometimes I'll guard. Sometimes I'll guard. Item allows you to use any items you have in your inventory. That makes sense. Okay, good, good. Okay, cool. I think I got this. You have to read this if you need to. Probably shouldn't be spending it, but let me stand in. Okay, uh, use attack. I didn't know balloons had life points. Oh, I see. <laughs> you dumbed it, it's a balloon. <laughs> the funniest thing ever. Oh, that's so cute. I love that. Alright. You punched a balloon to death. <laughs> you are now free to leave and continue your quest. Cool, awesome. Let's not... Okay, let's, let's get out of here. Oh good, okay, there used to be a bug where if you come out of here, it would repeat the exact same scene, but I'm so glad Danny fixed that. Well done, Danny. All right, we're going on. Let's head to the tavern. I'll explain there. Okay, we're going to the tavern. This must be a shop. That also must be a shop in... Okay, well, there's booze, so that means that's a tavern. Should I... Uh, let's just explore first, why not? Hello... Oh, I'm sorry. We were talking to me over the counter of the common. Ah! I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Here, I'll just click this space right here. I did! Nope. Okay, fine. You know what? Fine. I'll come back later. Is there nothing in the trash can? Why is it always a jar? Alright, anyway. Probably can't go there, but I'll just check it out just in case. Oh, <laughs> excuse you. <laughs> All right, moving on. Let's go to the end. Just because I can. Hello. How do I? I did. Okay, maybe I can't do any of this right now because I need to go to the tavern, which makes sense. Kind of quest things and everything, you know. All right, we're going on. Hello. The mindscape seems to have taken on the attributes of a role-playing video game. That explains the pixels and stuff. The entire mindscape has taken on a map similar to that you'd see in a fantasy game. It controls, it contains monsters, magic, towns, and mythological creatures. And due to this being a nightmare, many aspects from your other media you've consumed have found their way into this world. Why couldn't you have watched a documentary before bed or something? Instead, we're trapped in a nonsensical world of magic and monsters. Oh, that's funny. Ooh, magic. Look at that little face. Look at that face. That's adorable. Focus, Thomas. Indeed. Sorry. So basically, we're in some nightmarish RPG, right? In simpler terms, yes. I know RPGs. This will be. This will all be fine, Logan. We'll get the others and get to subconscious and fix all of this. I promise. Okay. I hope so. It'll be okay, Logan. You might even have fun. <laughs> Logan, having fun? Falsehood. Some, somehow I doubt I'll enjoy myself in a nightmare untethered to reality or reason cemented in the fantasy world of an RPG. It'll be okay, Logan. Look, first thing we need to do is explore the town and stock up on supplies for our battles. That's a fair, that's fair. Looks like my class is here, so I could use magic or weapons or whatever I'd like. Seems to fit Thomas. It seems my class is wizard? Ah, cool, you'll get to use magic and spells. 
You know, in most RPGs, the wizards are the smartest characters. It takes study, focus, and intelligence to do spells. At least I got a decent class. Indeed. Great class. That's the spirit. <laughs> so now we just gotta get gear and go any place nearby with monsters to fight for money. Why would monsters drop money? Oh, Logan. Oh, Logan. It's an RPG, Logan. That's just how things work. <laughs> There's a forest north of here with various populations of small monsters. I believe that's also the way leading to the Corpus Callosum. Callosum. Oh, is that, is, that, is, that, is that a part of the brain? I'm dumb, so I don't know if that's a part of the brain or not. It might be. Cool. That's the bridge between the hemisphere. Oh, there, there it is. You can travel to the right hemisphere to find Patton and Roman. That's right, because most of the fandom says a Logan and Virgil are left, Patton and Roman are right. That makes sense. What about Virgil? Wouldn't he mean left brain? The past of Corpus Callison is populated by small monsters. Therefore, eef, eef. That's fine. I believe you and I would be able to make our way past them. Wait, is this supposed to be? Nah, no, it doesn't matter. The path that goes deeper into the left hemisphere is blocked by more intimidating monsters. To get past them, we'll need Patton and Roman's help. It's a little long. Got it, let's get started. All right. I mean, it's good that it's long. It's cool. All right, so what about you? Hello there, feel free to relax in my tavern. Oh my god. Ugh. Yes, but also no. But also yes. All right, so that's the tavern. I think now we can start... Um, Oh, okay. I think we actually have to fight monsters first because I have absolutely no goal. So we need to go start, start fighting monsters. Oh, that was fast. Um, well, actually, Thomas, who told you to do that? We're gonna do. Nice. I know. I'm keeping. I'm keeping close tabs on stuff. see if we can still buy things. I want to figure out the shop system first before I do anything. Because, like, that was having a bit of problems with that. Let's see here. How do I do this? Is it, like... No. How? I'm trying. Is it if I enter? Oh, I have to press enter. Okay. That makes more sense. Okay. There's nothing. Why is there nothing there? Hmm. There usually should be stuff there. Okay, let's try over here. Okay, that's a problem. That is a problem. Alright. Fendo? Okay, well this is fine, but... Okay, well let me, let me keep fighting a little bit more, just in case.
Hmm. Okay, since I leveled up, let's see if that triggered anything. If not, I'll have to contact. No? Okay. Oh! I am a dunce! I am a dunce! You have to press it twice! Ah. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, one second. Let me just... Text Danny back and tell them that I got it. Okay, well, well, that was like 20 minutes of. <laughs> I'm such a. I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. All right, well. Okay. Yep, yep. No problem. No problem. All right. <laughs> uh, laugh with that with me. Laugh with me. Laugh with me. Laugh with me at my stupidity. Okay. Uh, we're gonna sleep because um, it's only 70 and I want to save up for the cool weapon so that everything will be okay so this I'm gonna say just as of now um, this game can get very uh, no I did not want to go in there this game can get very hard and when I and when I say very hard I mean that uh, you're gonna have to grind a lot in order to get to the certain types of like enemies and stuff and i like it on me i enjoy games that grind Ooh, what is this does it tell it doesn't tell us the monster name but that's okay we don't need to know the monster name Ooh, that was pretty powerful it's almost like we finished it off yeah Mm, excuse me. Didn't need to burp in my accident. Thomas's party, what's the prize? Oh! Oof. Looks like a bunch of Zubats. Oh, wonderful. What do I have? What do I do? Let's try this. We're already down. Okay, fine, whatever. Uh. Okay, fine. This will work. Here we go. I don't know how to do Let's Plays, so I'm just kind of talking as I see fit. Probably should have gone with the other one, because this one's open. Oh, crit. There's a crit. There's a crit right there. Nice. Please don't miss. Yes. All right. So right now we're just saving up for those, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Say, oh, weapons. Weapons and defense stuff. That's gonna be good. It's gonna be good for us. Okay. I remember correctly. No, go back. There we go. Back is escape. We need to do magic for this guy. Because he, he's horrible. Or they. I don't even know. <laughs> Probably gender fluid. Um. Escape. There we go. Yeah, we're 
we're fine. Let's just keep fighting until our MP is gone and our HP is okay. There we go. This is really fun. I've always loved RPG games and this is just great. And the fact that it's Singer Scythe just makes it even better, honestly. This is just awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Tanny, for making this. I'm just so excited to share this with you guys. It's gonna be great. All right, weapon shop. This is what we need. Welcome to the weapon shop. Can I see a fighting, I can see a fighting spirit in you. Almost as if you're trying to escape a nightmare. Well, no, er. <laughs> What can I do for you? All right. Um, enter twice. All right, this is a 34, so let's buy that. And check. Okay. And then we have to, like, welcome. Thanks for showing up. Remember to equip your stuff. Yeah, that's right. You have to equip it. Let's see here. Good. Good, good, good. Equip. Uh, that's right, you have to press it first. And for the sword. And it's a shield. Got it. And then we'll just go. I guess we could have done optimized. Oh well, that's fine. I like to do it myself. And then I think we have enough money for Logan's stuff over here in the magic shop. And no. <laughs> Baby's first magic stick. <laughs> magic amulet. Oh goodness. Okay, um, which one? Which one? I think this one, because it'll give it'll give Logan a bit more magic power. Okay, and then we're gonna have to keep fighting. You're welcome. We appreciate it. So we're gonna equip with Logan. Perfect. We'll do that. All right. Awesome. We don't have enough money to sleep at the end, so we won't do that yet. But we have weapon upgrades, so now everything should be easier to kill. Let's see. Let's go. We'll see how this goes. Ooh. Ooh, that's right, I forgot. He, he, oh, how did I get a zero? Yeah, this is so much easier. This is great. Level three. Awesome. I am excited. Just gonna keep. I know I probably should like keep going up, but this is how I like to play the game. I might put like description down below about like when I'm grinding so that you, you guys can skip if you want to so you guys don't have to like see every single freaking thing that I'm doing if you guys don't like grinding either way it's good also wanted to apologize for any background noise you hear um I have a I just have a simple um skull candy mic with headphones that's all I have I mean I'm not really a gamer Ooh. Got a crit. All right. So we're going to go north. Um Right, north is the way we need to go. That's right. Okay, we're going to sleep in the inn first. And then we're going to get the amulet for Logan. You did. Thank you very much. Okay. And I should have enough. Let me see. How many do I have? I have... Oh yeah, that's perfect. That's enough for Logan's amulet. And that way we can continue on. <laughs> uh, yes. Okay. Get out of that. 
and then if they need to come back we have enough to stay at the inn another night but i might buy a few of those things that like the magic potions that this guy had no this guy this guy first let me equip Optimized. Wonderful. Okay. We good. We good. We good. First, I want to check to see what's like. What's this way? Hello. Ooh. What is this? I don't remember this being here. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go back up. I'm gonna go back up. Oh, what? I can't go back up. No. 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 What is this? I have no idea what this is. Oh, oh. I think, I think that's the place to Virgil's region. Can I seriously not get back up? Oh no. Please let me get back up. Please, I can't fight that thing. Oh, oh, thank God, thank God. Whew. Okay, how about this way? Can we go this way? <laughs> Proceeds to almost get stuck in the area and then it's like, oh, what's this way? Oh. <laughs> oh, that scared me. Okay, let me, you know what? You know what I should do? Ha. Yes, I should do that. <laughs> okay, we're going on. Is there anything else I need to do here? Anything at all? Nope, we're going on. Uh, oh, crap, scared me. This is nice. And now, traversing this area is much easier than it would have been before. Okay, you know what, I probably should have gotten something. Is, is this the way? This might be the way. Do you know the way? to go north. I think this is the way. No? No? Okay, that's not the way. Let's keep going. Let's try it. long this is gonna be like this episode but it sure it shouldn't be too long though that was not the way to go as far as I remember there's no like big big chests in this forest at least not yet <coughs> as far as right now I don't really need to do anything like big Okay, here's the way. Force of the Corpus Callus. This is where we need to go. Awesome. Well, this is the bridge to the right hemisphere. We'll go there and find Roman and Patton. Then bring them back to help get to the deeper mind to find Virgil. And that's probably the dark forest where that big monster was there. Whew. Yeah, don't, don't get stuck down there. The right hemisphere is less grounded in reason than this one, meaning there will be a lot more danger and madness. Eee, goodness gracious. It'll be exciting, you know, I'm excited for this. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Awesome. I, aw, oh goodness, it's Virgil. Okay, well, you'll, you'll see him again, buddy. We'll see him again. Moving on. Right hemisphere. Okay, ooh, snow. What is this way? There's like three different ways. Let's go this way first. Okay, can, oh, hello. Scorpions. Kind of. Ooh, hello. Yeah, let's fight. Ooh. Hey, don't hurt Thomas. On second thought, 
we should find an antidote. Good, level four. Lecture. Okay, we're gonna go up because we need to find an antidote for Thomas quickly. So we're gonna go up to Roman City. Oh, this is great. Yeah, yeah, we need to find it. It would probably be in this area where they where they have the antidote, I think. Hello. Home of the Roman Sanders Battle Shop. Presented and funded by Prince Roman Sanders. Oh goodness, I forgot about this. Sorry, I have to say that every time. <laughs> oh goodness. <laughs> uh, what can I do for you? Oh, d do you have four? I, I didn't read that right. Okay. <laughs> Nerd stuff. Nerd stuff. I'm gonna geek out about that every single time. Sword, shield, red lipstick. Oh goodness. Is this the Roman Sanders? <laughs> I think, I think Logan can wear this. I can't remember for sure, but I think, oh yeah. Let's write the magic amulet. No, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let him keep wearing the magic amulet. All right, well we need to find the antidote and it's not here. So we're gonna keep going. I think there's a shop. Yep, there's a shop right there. I know, I know, I know. I need to buy a bunch of these. Because apparently there's a lot of stuff that has poison here. Welcome to Prince Roman's General Store. One of them presented by Prince Roman Sanders. Still here too. He's like, eh, whatever. Okay. Antidote, here we go. Here it is. Let's buy... Nope, nope. That's too many. Let's just buy one for now. No, I'm gonna need more than that. That's good. Excuse me, just in case. We'll leave all this for now. We can just go to in, which is actually quite cheaper than a lot of that stuff that's in there. But I will be buying everything just for the sake of completion. And yes, Thomas, you need help. Okay. Status. Is this item? It's item. That's what I need. Antidote. Uh, item. Yes. Yay. Go sleep. Go sleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. Alright. Stay. Enjoy your stay. Alright. And I think this is where we're going to leave it off for the first episode. Um, we, um, uh, finish the little village we got to roman's part we didn't battle a boss yet but we did explore quite a lot um i might do some grinding off camera or i might just going down let, let me know down in the comments if you want me to grind on camera or not um i'll go ahead and like explore the village next time uh, <laughs> thank you all so much for joining me again i'm seth hyvenoff and um, let me know what I can do to make my quality of the camera better, quality of my uh, screen better, and thank you all so much, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!